Congratulations on wanting to take the shortcut to easier brass playing. G'day, I'm Greg Spence and let's talk about the dopamine shot. What on earth is the dopamine shot? Have you got an obstruction in your playing? Have you got something stopping you from playing the way that you want to, that dream avatar, that stage you want to be on, the, you know, the perfect gig? What's in the way? Well, you're making errors physically. If there were no errors, you'd be on that stage. So what we're working on here is detecting the errors that you're making and correcting them. How do we correct an error? Well, we tell the brain, Brian here, who's keeping you alive and taking care of all the processes of playing at the same time, he's got a big job. He's making an error. He thinks that when you're playing, for example, this is the error that I used to have all the time, the Valsalva maneuver, the closing of the throat, overactivation of the abdominal muscles, putting tension on the throat and closing it, clicking and all sorts of noises, throaticulation I call that. That's an error and it's got a feeling attached to it. So what do we do to reprogram? We tell Brian, don't do that, do this. And we do a drill and we go, okay, body's concert hall breath, for example. Back of the tongue out of the way, everything's open, throat's open, playing, easy. So what we're doing with that feeling, hey Brian, next time I go to play the instrument, don't do that, do this. That's the feeling I want when I'm playing. Okay, so then next time you go to play your instrument, you recognize <laughs> you go to play and everything locks up. Now that's an error. We don't want that error. So Brian, sorry, you probably forgot, uh, but let's not do that. Let's do this. And we go around in a loop and loop and an error loop. It keeps doing it. Brian keeps making the same mistake because he doesn't quite get yet the feeling or the understanding of why we're doing it. But eventually, if you keep telling him enough, no, 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 we're not doing that any, and I got to the, hit the wall time. I refused to play with the Valsalva maneuver, the closed throat anymore. I said, Brian, we're not doing that anymore. Look, this is how it works. <sighs> let's keep the body relaxed. Let's not lock the throat. Eventually, we pick up the instrument and Brian allows me to go <sighs> and plays a note. And that moment of, that's what I want, just do that, releases the dopamine. What's happening when we create an error, acetylcholine, epinephrine get released, it's a brain chemical, frustration chemical, there's a little concoction in the brain, error, error, frustration, frustration, frustration. Then what happens when we achieve the result that we want, we get a shot of dopamine, and that tells Brian, yes, mate, that's what we wanna do. When we keep getting those shots of dopamine, the brain starts to change, it starts to learn. These experiences happen uh, all the time when we're practicing. If you practice the efficient, correct way, you can detect the errors and call out the errors and tell Brian not to create the error, but create the, the drill, the new sensation, the new feeling. The dopamine shot happens and overnight when you're sleeping, the brain changes. It's called myelin and myelin creates new neural pathways, thicker and thicker pathways until they become the new habit. Sounds real complex, but in actual fact, when you do this process, and I'm here to help you out, do it, find the error, and then replace it with a new technique. It's purely a matter of repetition of what we do want, and keep doing that until you get what you want. And Brian says, oh, you want me to do that? And we have an agreement there, let's just do that. All of a sudden that becomes the new habit, and you're on your way, error eliminated, dream avatar, travel the world playing. Hey guys, if you're wanting my help to develop an efficient three to four octave range with consistency, confidence, a killer sound, and a virtuoso technique, I've put everything I've learned over the last 35 years into one easy to follow program that you can benefit from right now at absolutely no cost for the next seven days. From your very first lesson, you'll begin to understand why you're having playing problems and why you're hitting ceilings. Our step-by-step -step comprehensive technical development program is for all brass players of all levels and all styles, and and I run live weekly masterclasses and live lessons via Zoom to make sure you're on the right track. If your mind isn't totally blown by day seven, you can opt out without being charged a cent.